So today we made coconut change and the difference is in the taste. Hi everyone, welcome back again to my YouTube channel. If you're first time watching my video, please don't forget to subscribe, turn on the bell so that you get notifications whenever I upload a new video. So the first thing I did was in a bowl, I added my flour. I actually used two cups of flour. You can try to use more or less. I added some baking powder, some sugar. I added less sugar because i wouldn't want it to be too sugary you can decide to add more you can decide to add less you can decide to substitute sugar so i added my milk flavor i mixed everything together this is actually the dry ingredient don't forget to add your salt i added a pinch of salt as well so i mixed my dry ingredients together and set aside in another bowl i actually use a plastic bowl in another bowl i added my my egg i used one egg i added my already melted butter and of course my coconut milk that's the main cocoa that's without this coconut milk then there is no coconut change i made my coconut milk to be very very thick and creamy because i know i won't be needing much water in my chinchin so i mixed everything together thoroughly added more to coconut milk because i noticed that the one i added was very small and i won't be needing extra water so i poured my already mixed flour into the bowl and mixed everything together At this point it's becoming already strong so the next thing i'll do is to rush into my washing sink wash my hand thoroughly left try right, left try right. wash it thoroughly because i'm going to use hand to make this into a doll i actually made a very little quantity because we are not much i'm just just me and my daughter so i made a very little quantity and i wouldn't want it to stay too long so this is the purpose of making this is actually for this video for the video content so at this point my dove is already ready so i'm going to cover it for 10 minutes while i prepare my table for cutting the chinchin into my desired shape so here i have to cut the dove into two roll it out then cut and slice my chinchin into my desired shape while i was doing this i already have my oil on the fire because i've been needing a very very hot oil for this chinchin so at this point i've already cut my chinchin into my desired shape my oil is already on the fire very very hot i have to pour it in and of course turn it immediately because i so that i won't have it gum together with each other at this point i've separated everything because the oil is very very hot i'm turning it consistently continually so that i won't have it jammed together with each other or gum together or whatever you decide to call it at this point guys my chinchin is ready you can decide to cut in desired shape size as you can see i have two shapes here so i made one lighter and one brown so guys 